So here's the all-purpose thermoplastic pellets I was talking about. You take a couple, you put some out, you make a shape, but then the shape isn't quite right. So what do you do? Well, first I take all these and then I heat them up on a spatula or a spoon. And then once they're on the spoon, you can add a little tiny bit of water so it doesn't stick too much. I would put this on top and let it heat up. Watch this in a second. Water's on. Keep your hand further away from the spoon. And just maybe the very edge. There. Once it starts to get clear, you're ready to make your shape or repair your shape. That looks good. And then you can kind of just peel that off. And you have a little chip right there. Might be a little hot, but take a second. It'll still be warm, you take it off. So say that's your shape, but there was an error in it, what you built. There's a little tiny divot there. So in the shape, there's an imperfection in the center. They bought really fast and then it turns into that white material that you want. So there's your thermoplastic with the error that you have and you want to fix it. And you want it to be smooth. So a couple things you can do is you can heat that up in the center just a little bit and then add a couple balls. There's a couple ways you can do that. I would use something that has a handle that's not going to hurt you. So just a little water on that it helps it transmit the heat right to those balls and that wooden handle protects your hand. Make sure that gets clear. And once it's clear, you're ready to go. We could heat up this. We could heat the center part or just put this to here. There we go. Just put it right to it. Pick it up. That should heat nicely together. There's going to be a slight bit of a bump in all the areas. So you can go back with a spoon once you're done. A warm spoon, a hot spoon, right? And you can reshape this. Touch that against there with both hands and maybe smooth it out just a little bit and you have an original shape again. So remember that heat is going to combine. Go back on your fingers to make the original roundness of the shape. No bulginess. Now you can see there's a new shape. Oh, my fingerprint there for the heat. A little more heat and get rid of that. But you have solved the problem and it has with the heat chemically bonded to the other plastic, and it's not coming off.